One dead in University of Utah shooting has coaxed hunt for suspect. Police are on the hunt for a suspected gunman after one person was killed in a shooting near the University of Utah Monday night. Police said, suspect Austin Bullhane. 24 is still at large, hours after the victim was fatally shot during a carjacking at the gate of Red Butte Canyon just east of the school, according to University of Utah Police Chief Dale Prothy. Salt Lake City Police received reports of a man with a gunshot wound to the head shortly after 9 p.m., and students were advised to take shelter with an alert that red shots fired. Red Butte Canyon Shelter in place Butane's wife was injured when she appeared on campus and reported that her husband assaulted her while they were camping in the canyon just east of the school, Brophy said. It remains unclear when Butane's wife made the report and how the alleged assault was linked to the carjacking. Butane, who was last seen in black clothing and a beanie, has a cross tattooed on his face and may have also been driving a forest green pickup truck with a Colorado license plate, according to the university. The Department of Public Safety dispatched a helicopter crew to assist the University of Utah Police and several authorities, including the FBI, swarmed the area as the manhunt continues. Police have not yet identified the name or gender of the carjacking victim. Utah Gov. Garrett Herbert issued a statement on Twitter, writing, Fervent prayers for all dealing with the number sign Utah shooting tonight. Stay safe and follow directions to shelter in place. Butane's brotherly Butane told the Daily News he was shocked to learn his brother was a suspect in the shooting. Since he hadn't heard from the 24-year-old for several months months since he skipped a role in Wisconsin, Lee Butane would not elaborate on his brother's criminal history. Although public records show Austin Butane has also been arrested in Ohio and Alabama.